I, and and um, it, it has to be astounding to you, uh, given your background, uh, that so many Americans seem uh, almost glib about the creeping authoritarianism that's happening in the United States, are also looking at how some of these so-called uh, Cold War hawks that, that spent their life claiming to be Cold War hawks uh, attack people like you and also, of course, uh, drove uh, a Jewish refugee from the Soviet Union uh, out of his position at the White House, Lieutenant Colonel Vindman. It's absolutely shocking. An American hero who won a Purple Heart, who, who earned a Purple Heart uh, in, in Iraq, um, Donald Trump pushed him out of service to this country and Republicans stood by and let him do it. You know, what scares me the most isn't that I know what people like Trump and his cronies can do. It's that authoritarians always come up with things that we cannot imagine, cannot even predict. And it's a special talent of people who think only about themselves, only about their money, their power. And you very often hear, oh, doesn't he know how bad that looks? Or surely he, he would never do that. They don't care. They will do anything because they have too much to lose. The way authoritarians think is that anything they do to stay in power is fine as long as it works. Because with power, they can avoid consequences, they can avoid prosecution, they can cover their tracks, and they pardon their friends and allies. So breaking traditions, breaking the rule, even breaking the law, they think it won't matter if they win. So they're capable of absolutely anything.